Cone Racers are a scheme that was developed by Reborn some years ago. And it's that we go on our tours around the country, we go into our, the local theatre, usually the biggest theatre in that city, and it's a creative project in which the young dancers from local schools usually contribute work and ideas and um, are led by two company dancers, usually. And this results in a performance before one of our performances at the theatre on our tour in front of, usually, a sold-out audience. I mean, five weeks and only like one Saturday is a lot of pressure in a way, but in a good way. What I like about it as well, getting to like meet new people and see what their strengths are, and you can like work together, and it's a really good experience. I think at this point, if they're really serious about going into the profession, like this, the way this we've been working is like how you would work. You know, it's full on, they're long days, there's lots of information you've got to take in, so the whole overall experience of that is, is really valuable in deciding whether actually you really want to do it. It's just been part of a big company and it's going to help you in the future when you do get involved in a big company, you're going to know what it's all about and what it's like and the rehearsal process and the performance process, I think it's going to really help you when you're in the professional world. Obviously Matthew Bourne is a very well respected artist and choreographer within the world of contemporary dance and just dance as overall really, so to be a part of something that he's kind of um, involved in as well, it's a big opportunity for me as well. Just all the seats there and you're just imagining the people there. The adrenaline like kicks in then. It's just a really good feeling like, to be on a massive stage. Well, I think the venues that get involved in the, the Curtain Razor projects create relationships with local people in a, new, in a new and different way, in a unique way. It's not just about building audiences, it's about building relationships and having a, a connection with the community, I think. And those things are very, very important, I think, today when we are trying to build audiences and we are trying to create those sort of relationships and the theatre's not a scary place to come. I've got quite a bit of a adrenaline like building up but it's good because I kind of use it to power me through and um, to try like to keep me focused as well just kind of get into the intention of the piece or whatever's needed for me to go out there and really put on a good performance. It's local young people they're very much on the side they're very supportive but also I think they see the beginnings of something in young people that how talent can be nurtured quite quickly actually and, and how surprised they are sometimes at what they've achieved in such a short space of time. It may seem a little thing, it may sort of five minutes performance in the local theatre, but it could just start something that could last a lifetime.